when I was about five or six years old, um, my favorite toy was a tape recorder. I, I, I don't even remember how I got it, when I got it. Maybe it might have been my older brothers, but it was a small little black box with a little red button for record. I remember it as if it's in my hands right now. And when I was old enough to understand what a recording studio was uh, on a very basic level, I always knew I was going to have some sort of studio. And little by little, I was able to build a studio. And my band Shadow Gallery was in a position to take some royalty money we made after the first and second album started to sell and buy equipment. But it wasn't quite right. And so I still kept my sights on building a studio next to my house. I finally got the opportunity uh, about five years ago to buy a house and, and you know, clear out the driveway and just start from scratch and build a studio with uh, enough space for me to do what I want to do. And there's not one day I take this for granted. You know, just every day I love being in here. Being a musician, it, it's the idea of taking an opportunity, a second, a slice of life, and saying, I'm going to create something right now. And then coupling that with an absolute sheer determination of coming up with something unique, uh, new, and everlasting. Can I create something emotional that'll make you feel happy, or you feel sad, or me feel sad? You go with what is going to create that emotion. And that is so empowering to be able to do that. It's really just being able to create, you know, maybe have the, the ability to inspire somebody or make them feel something they haven't felt before. Because when you do that, you're changing the world. Maybe just one tiny little bit.